Hello, comrades. I'm very sad. Why did he have to die? It is a bear. It isn't. It really isn't. <gasps> but we shall see. We shall see Thorfinn's Revenge on Askeladd on episode 5 called The Churl's Son. Oh no. I just realized that he, oh my God. Okay, so yes, in the last episode, I was sad and heartbroken. But now that I just see him on this ship, just him, I've realized that Leif and all the other men are dumb because they didn't even notice that that freaking Thorfinn was off the ship. Come on, dude. What is wrong with you guys? I know Thorfinn wants revenge, but is this really the right path? At such a young age? Hmm. Well, I think that he should be fine. I mean, considering that I watched Fullmetal Alchemist Brotherhood, my two brothers were fine. Except... Except... Thorfinn is alone! <laughs> he has no one! He has to fight alone! Right, right, right. Hold on. You got to uh, take notes, kids. That's what I do. Find a nice girl. Well, then why don't you try being nice yourself? Mm. Thorfinn. I don't care. I want Thorfinn. Where's Thorfinn? Poor Thorfinn. <gasps> the hardship he has to face. Water. Yeah. <laughs> it's making me sad. What the? No. What the crap? He 
just killed Thorfett's father and now you're killing innocent people? Gosh. Seriously, they're sleeping after what they did? And no way to fight back. Why are they like this? Oh, you guys are disgusting. Hmm. Oh. Don't, don't, no, 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 no. Thorfinn. This is bad. This is bad. Please put the down shore down. You was up this whole entire time? Wait a minute. Was he planning to let Thorfinn... No. No, this is Enskelet. He wouldn't let Thorfinn kill him. Would he? だったっけな。勾配。うん。なんだ生き残るか。いや、あれだろ。息子だろ。用務の通らるの。ああ、まだ生きてたのか。ああ、しゃったらから。ご苦労なことって。急への仇だ。お前に決闘を仕込む。
I would refuse to. I'm the most disgusting oi ever. Don't eat it! I thought so. I'm about to cry. Wow. There's no way Yelva is just being strong. Always. Let it all you out, Yelva. Yeah, I knew she was holding it all in, distracting herself with work.
の地区に住んでたので、そういうのはなかったです。それだけのことだよ。Careful there, Thorfinn. I'm just hurt. Yeah, dude. Oh, Oh, there goes his first killing. <gasps> mm, he's smart now. He's using a dagger instead of a sword. So he can't carry one with his height. You're fine, Thorfinn. You could do this. Man, these soundtracks are just god tier. Ugh, yes. Yeah, he's getting his own food now. ああ。Got this, Thorfinn. Okay, maybe he's okay, maybe he's not completely ready. Okay, 
もういいんじゃねえかマジで死んじまうぜ<笑>あんだよやれっつのはお前じゃねえか<笑> Wait Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him! You already killed Thor's already! Thank goodness. Because you're a kid. Why is he like this towards a orphan? He's getting more serious by the second. Well, that was episode five of the Trill Sun. Now, I will say, I do feel bad for Yelva. She has to do all the chores alone. But most importantly, that she's trying to keep it together for her mom, for others that are worried and concerned for her about her father dying and her brother missing. I also felt bad for Helga because she just lost her husband and now she has a missing son. They're having it hard. And Lave, what a great man. Willing to go find Dorfin, no matter how many years it takes. He swore that he will find him. I wonder how long he will find him. That's that's the question I want to know. And then you have Thorfinn, who lost his father, is wanting revenge against Askelad. Thorfinn has lost twice. One, because he didn't know what he was doing. He just knows that a sword kills someone. He was about to kill Askeladd in his sleep, which Askeladd wasn't really asleep. But he decided not to because that's not what a warrior would do. But then he realized with the dagger would be his best shot which he did kill the werewolf that was about to attack him and that was his first kill he also was starving and thirsty and luckily there was water for him the food uh, he had to eat the leftover which was so upsetting to him because he couldn't really do anything for himself and then he had to eat mushroom, but it doesn't help if he doesn't know what is bad for him or what's good for him. But now he can but now he can eat, which is great. He has killed the Rolo, the bunny, and whatever else is in the forest that he can eat and survive. He then goes up against Askeladd again. He's improved a little bit, but not to the point where he can actually be a good challenge for Askeladd. And because they were in the middle of a, 
this is a battle of dead or alive, he basically would have been dead. But Askeladd is not the type who is fond of killing kids. Huh? Didn't you just kill... Didn't you just kill a village of children that were in the... Actually, you know what? I don't think I've seen Askeladd kill. I think his men were the ones doing the killing. But anyways. Uh, yeah, so... Askeladd promised him that if he does well in a battlefield, he will go up against him some other time. Also, I, mm, I, I don't know what Askeladd, Askeladd's very, very mysterious because he's very brutal to, to Thorfinn. I mean, Askeladd's very, a very interesting character. He's very mysterious. I do not understand. Because one, he was awake the whole time when Thorfinn was about to kill him. He then battles Thorfinn, telling him the advice that he shouldn't have the sword to carry his weight. And then the third one is that he kept beating him so many times, which was very brutal. But, like, I think in a way it was trying, and he kept him alive. And, I don't know, I feel like he knows this is Thor's son. And he knows very well that Thor is, is very strong. So the fact that he's keeping Thorfinn alive, I feel like he already knows that he will die at some point in the future. Because he will be getting old. Whereas Thorfinn will have more strength and more anger towards him as he gets older. I don't know. He's a very mysterious person. That's all I gotta say about that. But either way, I'm not happy with Thor's death. Makes me sad. Anyways, that's it. Thank you, comrades, for joining me on watching episode 5 of Finland Saga. And I want all of you lovely comrades to have a wonderful, beautiful, and an amazing day. Not kidding. Love you, comrades. Bye!